Hi, my name is Mary Ann Wagner. I'm a pediatric occupational therapist with Innovative Services Northwest. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make your own iPad, tablet, or phone stand that you can use for your telehealth sessions. So first you need to gather your materials. All you really need is a cardboard box, duct tape, and some scissors. So you're gonna wanna first make sure that your cardboard box is completely taken apart um, and unfolded. And so what you're gonna do first is take your box long ways and you're gonna take the opposite end and fold it up to make sort of a triangle shape working along the corrugated edges. As you can tell, this box is corrugated horizontally. So that's the way that you're gonna fold. So you're gonna bring it forward to make a triangle like this. So you have your triangle and as you can see, you're gonna need to make a little lip at the edge so that um, your device doesn't slip off. So first you need to determine the angle that you want for your device. So if you fold it, farther down, then it's going to be more of a slant looking upwards. And if you decrease the angle, it's going to be straighter like so. Um, and if you, if your box is too long, like mine is, you'll need to unfold it and take the opposite end and you're going to fold it up like so to make it shorter and it also will be more supportive. So I'm gonna fold mine one more time. And you wanna fold right along the corrugated edges so that it's easy. Fold and bring it forward again. Make your triangle and to increase the angle take the part that you folded right here, you're going to fold that down and scoot it all the way back like that. So now this is kind of a nicer angle and you can test it with your device too to make sure that it doesn't slip. You have your basic shape down and your device fits. Next thing you want to do is you, may, well, you want to make a little lip for your device to make sure that it stays, right? So something along the lines of this. And as you can see, mine is like a bit short right here. So yours is like mine and you need a little more space to work with and you've already taped it. You can just make another fold along the corrugated edge. And tape it down so that there's another little triangle going on. And you'll want a nice long piece of duct tape for this one.
You want to fold it pretty tight in so that it gives you a little bit. Like so. So you have a nice little support here for your device so that it doesn't end up slipping off. And then you're basically done here. What you want to do before you cover it all in duct tape um, and decorate it if you like is you want to add duct tape to areas that you feel might be weak. For example, this box has slits right here. So I'm definitely going to cover these areas with tape, um, potentially even on both sides. Um, and another area that tends to be weak is this angle right here. So I like to put tape on the opposite side as well. 